Cleveland city leaders met today hoping to help refugees who want to come to Cleveland. Our Meg Shaw with a new program in the works that would roll out the red carpet for those seeking asylum. Meg? Yeah. That's right. The plan is in its infancy stages. Now, a similar program in Dayton took three years to implement. So, today I talked to a refugee from Nepal that was at that summit. He moved to Cleveland seven years ago. He explained to me why this program is so important to Cleveland. Nar Pradhan located to Cleveland with five of his family members in 2008 after spending 17 years in a refugee camp in Nepal. The process wasn't easy. It was very challenging. And it was difficult to get the employment. NAR told me one of the biggest difficulties was the language barrier, holding a lot of refugees back from employment. Though they are hard workers, but because of language, it's difficult to get job. But city leaders want to make it easier for refugees with the Open Doors to a Welcoming City program. Since 2012, nearly 600 refugees have settled in Cleveland, and Councilman Joe Simperman told me the city wants to double that number in the next five years. How do we use what we already have to welcome even more people so that in five years, Cleveland becomes the go-to place for people who are coming from all over the world? Simperman said the plan will not only help our schools and communities, but it'll improve Cleveland's corporate sector. How do you compete on an international level? You welcome international talent, and that's what this room is all about today. NAR said so far the city is doing well at retaining refugees. However, there is still room for improvement. Cleveland can help refugees to uh, open more job opportunities. Like our, most of our people, they don't speak language, like English language. Because of that, they are lacking behind for employment. So in five years, the goal of the program is to welcome 1,500 refugees a year and become the number one city in the country for secondary migration. And everything from today's workshop will be reported to the community as a status update on what leaders are doing to retain and welcome refugees in Cleveland. Wow. Very